in our fight against corruption, I'm also suggesting that if it is possible, we should not only decentralize the prosecution of corruption to special prosecutor, we should commercialize it, say that individuals should be able to go and prosecute and then the reward should be good. In that case, I'm sure some young accountants and lawyers can come together and say, as for this case, we won't allow it to go. Because if we get 20% of it, our economy recovery program will have been successful. <laughs> is that not it? Yes. So we should look at it. Because if we are losing 100%, what is wrong? We will be making a law to say, look, if you save us the money which has gone, we will give 20% to you. And if we do that at a country, at least we'll be able to bring back this money. And of course, it means the prosecution will not be at the whims and caprices of one individual or institution. If they refuse to go, Ace can go. If because he's, he has become my friend, he will not go, you can go. And that is the only way that I think we should protect the public purse and make it safe. I would like to assure that Ghana Audit Service, under my leadership, we remain committed to protecting the public purse, and we will do whatever it is in our capacity to continue doing. We call on the society, we call on Ghanaians to support us in protecting the public purse.